important gift of the renewal is to give every Catholic a conscious experience of the risen Lord. A conscious experience of the Lord therefore requires us to continually ask for a renewal of the Holy Spirit in our lives. Charismatic means gifts. We need to exercise the gifts. Gifts of healing, gifts of teaching, gifts of prophecy, so that the church becomes alive. If we don't exercise these gifts, then no one will know that Jesus is alive. How do you know Jesus is alive? When He heals, when He changes life, when He liberates people from bondages, and the renewal, if you want to keep yourself alive, exercise the gifts. We who have received the Holy Spirit are now called to impart the Spirit to all men and women so that they too can be gathered into the church and become one body of Christ. Every group to be alive must be a community on fire that is to say, always reaching out, always going out. They don't stay just together. They come together, yes, so that they could go out after being empowered by each other. Redeemer needs new people, new blood. And I mean to see more young people. Then the renewer is on the right track. Are we reading the signs of the times? What do our young people need? The Holy Spirit is the one who helps us to re-express, to lead people to Jesus in new ways. The gift of tongues is a powerful encounter with the Lord. When you pray in tongues, you realize that Jesus is Lord. It's a very beautiful gift, a very humble way of glorifying the Lord. It changes life. At the end of the day, there is only one tongue. It's a tongue of love. It is love that actually brings people together. And together, we build the church. Together, we set the community on fire because they will encounter Jesus through these gifts that they received. And in this way, we build the church. In this way, we make the church truly a sacrament of love and unity. Here I am to worship